Hey guys, Sam here. I'm making this video today in response to Jason's question on Twitter. Jason asked, where does the Libertarian Party stand on drug policy? And so hopefully I'll answer that question today. I'll give you a better understanding of where I stand and where the party in general stands in regards to drug legalization and the reasons we have for our beliefs. So to understand how libertarians feel about drug policy, we first have to understand how libertarians feel about laws in general. Libertarians would generally disagree with victimless crimes, and these are crimes that are either by personal choice or um, an individual's decisions that only affects that individual and has no effect on society. The typical libertarian would say, while I may not agree with it, it's none of my business. And this is really the same with drugs, abortion, or really any issue that is only pertaining to an individual. While libertarians generally would agree that an individual's personal choice to do drugs is okay as long as it affects only that individual, they do recognize that certain actions have consequences on society. And we do see a role for government here. Uh, so an example might be your freedom to, to use drugs might conflict with the protection of minors and children. And libertarians would generally be in favor of limits or um, on minimum age limits for drugs. Um, so whether that's 18 or 21, we don't want children having the quote-unquote freedom to use drugs. And I personally do believe that if a, ch a child is being raised in a home where their parents are doing drugs, um, then the state does have a responsibility to step in and protect the welfare of that child. Even if it is the parent's personal choice to use those drugs, there is a consequence on society and on innocent individuals sometimes. And so, Jason, to answer your question on how libertarians feel about drug policy, there really are two schools of thought in the Libertarian Party, uh, which are would be considered mainstream. Some libertarians support the legalization of all drugs, whether that's marijuana, methamphetamine, or heroin, what have you. They don't see a role for the government in legislating what personal choices people can make. As long as that doesn't affect other people, they would argue that that's an, an individual's personal choice, and even if it may not be a wise choice, it's still their choice. I think many other libertarians might support the legalization of certain drugs, such as marijuana. Um, I guarantee that almost every libertarian you talk to would support the legalization of marijuana because the effects of marijuana are even less than that of alcohol. They may be wary, however, on legalizing some harder drugs, um, some more dangerous drugs. I can think of such as meth, heroin. We might not want all those drugs being legalized. However, we would all agree, basically with the Democratic Party, um, at least the Democrats in Colorado and Washington, that marijuana should be legalized um, and adults should have the freedom to use that drug. Well, thank you all so much for watching. Uh, it really is a pleasure making these videos for you, and I hope you learned something watching them. Uh, if you want to know more, you can subscribe to me on YouTube, or you can follow me on Twitter at A Young Libertarian. And this show is really fueled by you, so let me know either on Twitter or in the comments, any way you can get in touch with me. Give me a topic, an issue, something controversial you'd like me to discuss next. I'll tell you what my personal view is, what the view of the Libertarian Party in general is, and maybe what the view of some opposing political philosophies are. Thank you all so much, and I'll see you later.